my lordship. The dream I had a couple of days ago still troubles me. Because I, I can't really find interpretation to it. Father Tim, I thought you prayed about it. I did, my lord. But something still tells me it has to do with my transfer to Umabani community. Father Tim, yes, my lord. I don't expect you. A Holy Ghost filled father like you. A vibrant Holy Ghost filled father like you. To be afraid of going on transfer to anywhere. As a matter of fact, I decided to send you here. Because I believed in you. And I know how charismatic you are. So, Father Tim, be steadfast and always believe that the Lord Jesus Christ will always come to our rescue. Whatever obstacle may meet your life, He's there to help us. You make a way for us. Thank you, my Lordship, for your fatherly advice. Thank you. Let me take my leave now so that I can prepare for tomorrow's journey. May the Lord Jesus Christ guide and protect you on your journey. Amen. Thank you, my Lord. you. It's my transfer to my Bali community. It's... It's, it's okay. It's... Uh, what really is wrong? I feel some sort of depression each time I think about it. I don't know why. Um, it's okay, Father Tim. Just believe you're going there with God. Our Holy Mary and the host of heaven. You have nothing to be afraid of. Absolutely nothing. The Lord is your strength. I believe in you. You'll be fine. But can I ask you a question? Yes, please. Can you come with me? Uh, Father Tim, you know I would love to, but it's not possible. It's okay. It's okay. I'm sorry. No, it's fine. Father Tim, you'll be fine. Our Holy Mary will be there with you. And I will keep praying for you. Okay? So, have you packed? So, that is the issue at hand. So, 
So how do we stop it? Yes, this is the best time to wear our thinking cap. I mean, we must not fold our hands and watch Roman Catholic doctrine. I mean, we've labored to keep this doctrine for many years. There's no way we allow it to be destroyed within a point of an hour. Impossible. So we will select from among ourselves some delegates who will convey our message to the bishop, who will pass it on to the Pope. Do we all agree to that? Yes. Yeah, yeah. 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 They shouldn't allow this to happen, no. They shouldn't allow it to happen at all, at all. Allow what? Uh -uh. To think that I'll live all my life without a man wearing this cloth. Mm. And then suddenly, they'll start allowing my, my junior ones to get married. No, now. That's not fair. It's not going to happen. Honestly, Sister Esther, you have a point. This is unfair. It's unfair. Look at us. We lived our lives as spinsters, serving the Lord, without giving birth to a child or even children that would take care of us during our old age. And now the Pope wants to do this to us. <laughs> Sisters, it's unfair. This is man's inhumanity to man. Sisters, I think we should take things easy. You know, I think we should take things easy and find a way to stop this mess from taking place. If not, it will definitely be a big slap on our faces. I would, be, I would rather die. Ah, no, now, not too much now. Um, I'm okay. you see, my, my heart is just broken. Eh? How can you explain? What do you think? Are you yeah, going to change everything? Don't my own. How can they change it? Mwena kaya ri na juwa Ezi monso uche muche bemo Mwena kaya ri na juwa Ezi monso uche muche bemo Ekwe kwa la kandu wa miremar Ezi monso uche muche bemo Ezi chimo 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 Ezi chimo kwa kisi mozi Ekwe kwa la kandu wa rio chitogi Chimo I don't need more to, I don't need more to chuku Chimu o, kebe mu o Ipe kwa la kandu wa mire maru Ebe mna chusiki Tupu ne ma mu mu ima ife ngabu Tupu mputu wa ima ife ngarurugi Ezi chimu o Ezi chimu wa na ma bagi e Ebi lim mi ri na mani Imbe gide mwa Aju wa na wa ya ri mwa Chimu wa Akama da zimba Ebe mna rrgar Chima gaya kwe Mwe mna gaya ri na ju wa Ezi mwa sa uche muche be Muche mo Muche mo chukwa Muche mo chukwa Ezi mwa sa uche muche be Ekwa kwa la kandu wa mire maru Ezi mwa sa uche muche be Muche mo Ekwa kwa la kandu wa mire maru Ezi mwa sa uche muche be Kwam nasa Osandu agwike Ezi chimu Agam na rrgara Rembo ebi ebi Chimu Ifo saruwa Ifo saruwa mebe Ifo saruwa Ifo saruwa mebe Mochimu Agam na rrgara 
gagi ma nasa A gagi ma wusa wara tata Ndureli kwe wabandi nkegie Moseli kwe metubanya kasa Ndi nyanya ndi fenesi wike Ezi chumwa Is it true? There is nothing to be afraid of. You see, the Bible makes us to understand that one with God is majority. So all you need to do now is to be fervent in prayers. Because even Jesus Christ our Lord went through trials and temptations doing his ministration work on earth. So, who are we? But one thing I know for sure, Father Tim, is that the Lord who sent you there would never abandon you. Amen. Thank you, Sister Mary. You are indeed proven to be a friend, indeed. Thank you once again. You're welcome, Father Tim. Um, you see, I will have to go with you to know your new place in case there's any need for me to come over and help. Um, but I have to come back today because um, I don't want to miss out on any church activity. Sure. Thank you, Father. Devil's palace. This is unbelievable. A shrine? A big shrine? At an entrance of a town? In our era? Cool. I smell battle. Father Tim. Our Holy Mary will see you through this in Jesus' name. Good afternoon, sister. Who asked for your greeting? Eh? Were you sent to this parish? 
business. Sister Amel, are you okay? Yes, I'm fine, Father. What did you say to her? Nothing more than greetings. That's serious. Well, let that not bother you, so long as you never offended her, okay? Yes, let's get to the bottom of the news. Do you remember Reverend Okafo? Oh! Yes. yes, that's Reverend Okafo! Yeah, okay, so let's go to our quarters, sir. Yeah. Father, this place is lovely. <laughs> of course, of course. I'm so happy for you. Yes, definitely. Oh. The joy of the Lord is our strength. Amen. Oh. to this beautiful parish. <laughs> so I felt it wise to come note his new place in case there's any message. I see. That is the most a holy act. Yes. It's an ungodly behavior for a reverend sister to leave her parish and follow a reverend father to his new place of work. Mm -hmm. I'm sure that her mother Mary must be disappointed yes. at this ungodly behavior. Um, but mother, I see nothing wrong with it. Father Tim is just a friend. Exactly what you are saying. Making friends with the opposite sex for a reverend sister is bad. That is if you know the too many of the dress you wear. Father Tim, <laughs> That's how it should be. Yes. We are still young and vibrant. Yes. We won't allow all these young girls to come here and, and then, you know, distract you. No. Anything you want, we are ready to take care of you. Take care of you. Take very good care of you. Yeah. you. <laughs> Anything you need, just call us. Whatever you need, just come here to teach. Welcome to our parish. Father, you're welcome. Father, you're welcome. Father. Welcome. Welcome. Father. <laughs> well, I'm sure you enjoy us. Yes, sir. We can now see the left block of the back of this young boy, St. George. I wonder. <laughs> Imagine a reverend sister of the Catholic order following a priest to his new place of work, all in the no name of friendship. Do you know she did not even show any remorse when we were talking to her? When we tried to go show her, she did not show any remorse. I began to wonder what will happen if people like this are given permission to have life partners. Hey. Oh. I personally, eh, I will have a heart attack. Yeah, we don't know. I will die. <laughs> now, see what we're going to do. We are going to keep a watch over him and make sure he doesn't drive away the spirit of God from this parish on account of adultery. Oh, yes. No. Adultery. Sister Esther, you are going to prepare a roaster of who will be cooking for him. God. And it is restricted to you, the Holy Sisters. Mm. Consider it done. We may now go in peace. Okay.
narekele menine Idema, 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 Chineke mo, Narekele. Is it Chimo, Chimo, Chimo? Is it Chimo, Quakis, Mosik? Ever Quala can do a real to I don't need more to, I don't need more to choose. Jimu, you be more. If the world can do one me rain, I rain. Amen, I choose again. To put them a moment in my finger. To put put away in my finger again. Yes, it's Jimu. Father, please, my mom has been sick for over a year now. Please, I need your help. Okay, um, we need to do a midnight prayer. Two days midnight prayers. And while you're doing that, you have to read um, Psalm, Psalm 51, Psalm 1 to 1, Psalm 1, and Can I see for a moment, please? Just keep your greeting to yourself. I hope there's no problem, sister. All would have been well if you did not allow the devil to use you as instrument of distraction. I don't really understand what you're talking about. What is this whole talk all about? Now listen to me. Let me make it point clear to you. I don't want to see you anywhere around Father Tim again. If I ever catch you, I am going to disgrace you. Holy Mary. Have I made myself point clear? You flat. Don't flat around a reverend father anymore. When she came to put up that drama at the church, I didn't take her so serious until she came to confront me. Hmm. Can you imagine that? I have already said it. That that sister has suspicious character. I'm just so ridiculous I don't even know what to say. A reverend sister coming to warn a kid to stay away from a young father. Can you imagine? Coming to warn me. Eh? As if, as if, as if he's her husband. What even pays me the most was, was that we didn't even discuss anything bad. Seriously, we didn't discuss anything bad at all. Don't mind her. I wonder who even made her a reverend sister. Or if she even knows the meaning of the clothes she wears on her body. Please, my friends, I have to go now, eh? Forget about that sister. I don't even know what she did. Please, please, you all. Alright, Jim, sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. We call you have this one that will be of very little interest to you. So that discussion has to do with the rules and regulations of this parish, how we operate here. So you know how we operate and the forest. You understand. That's all it is about. Court. What did you say? You can pick up from there. Uh, thank you, Father Zaya. Father Ting. In this parish, we do not permit a priest to interact with anything that they don't want to talk to all. And you are not supposed to be seen with a lady or a woman in your apartment. The only ladies that can enter your apartment are the members, the sisters of this church. Another thing is, here in this parish, only the reverend sisters 
are permitted to offer you. Last but not the least, on no account will you be seen in the village, both on the road or in someone's house, except you are on an errand of the parish by us or the bishop. As you can see, you just have to obey these rules and regulations, and there won't be any problem with us. That's it. Question? Yeah. All right. Feel free to ask me any question. Good. Who cooks for Reverend Fathers in this parish? Um, Father, we normally do that. But since you came, we are stopped from doing that. <laughs> well, I, I know in some parish they, they have special cook. Yeah. And in some seminarians like you, equally cook. Yeah. Yes. Um, that's all I just want to okay, confirm. Father. It's okay. Thank you, Father. God bless you. Peace of the Lord be with you. Thank you, Father.
father. Forgive them, for they do not know what they are doing. They need deliverance. Oh, deliver them, Father. Jesus name. As I walk on this evening, filled with the Holy Ghost, I discover that this community is in great captivity. They need God's intervention. So I, I decided to hold a deliverance mass, where by the grace of God, the sick will be healed, the lame will walk, and the blind will see, and the people will give their life to Christ. Enough! Enough of that rubbish! What did I say that is wrong, Father? Everything. I mean everything. All that nonsense you have been vomiting. Listen, young man. Young man, listen now. As far as I remain the head priest in this parish, nothing like that will happen. As simple as that. I have spoken. This is very strange. A healing mass prohibited in a parish. What then are they preaching? Are they really sure that it's God they are worshipping? My God, I need you to see me through these trials. to create confusion among us. Imagine such nonsense. He has come to show us that he has power more than us. Look at the whole me, Father Isaiah, mm. head priest of the parish, being told what to do. In a parish, my father has labored to build in years. Incredible. We must not sit down and watch him rain us before he does that. We must rain him first. That is the point. Before he pours more on us, we will rub him with shit all over the body. All over the body. We must show him powers. I mean, stronger powers. Eh? Mm -hmm. Shake hand of 
pressure your hands in my name of Jesus. Your husband will not leave you. Hey, who is that evil woman? I speak against that woman right now. I cut her right now in the name of Jesus. Hey, if that woman sees this water upon you, she will run away. She will run mad. Who is she that wants to spoil your matrimonial home? Hey, go and take your husband. Get it. Come and take it. You shall be the head and not the tail. You shall be the first in your class in the name of Jesus. Who is that evil uncle who is calling your brains? Hey, I correct your brain in the name of Jesus. I correct your brain in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, be corrected. Hey, this is well. To put them away, my finger. Carry the mark and no one shall trouble you. Don't watch your troubles you. Go and be first in your class in the name of Jesus. Go. I want you to get this. Testify the goodness of God, okay? God forgive me. Believe me, really. Let me know what you could not have done in the life. And you, yeah, you just said, whoever wants to steal your man from you, she will not succeed. You are carrying the mark of Christ. She did right in the name of Jesus. Everybody have recorded it. That man, that man, that spirit of doubting Thomas is out of him. As soon as he sees you, he takes over you. Go and be a married woman. Go. Go to his house right now and you go and take over. Everyone like a new one, you remember. What is this? Out. I say out. Taking your, your child. You can't be barren. In the name of Jesus, I, I declare and I destroy that evil power. You shall not be barren in the name of Jesus. Take your pregnancy in the name of Jesus. Lady, go and meet your man tonight. You shall come back to the call of your children. Go. If I saw you, if I saw you, 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 you, I you, I you, Thank you, Father. In the name of Jesus. Hey, hey you are so bad. I can't How long has this been? You, you're not born like that. You see, Francis is of the Lord. You believe in the name of Jesus? This young man was in bond like this. And by the reason of the Holy Ghost upon your life, you, man, you are delivered from this. You are delivered from this oppression. Be delivered from this oppression in the name of Jesus. Do you believe that you are not going home with these clutches? You are not going go home with these clutches in the name of Jesus. You are faithful already. In the name of Jesus. I'm 
All is well. Not really, Father. My mom is sick at home. Sick? Yes. 
What? What is wrong with her? She has a heart condition. Holy Mary. This is a difficult one. Um, can I see her now? Sure. That way. Okay. Get into the car. Get in. reason God called them to set the captives free those oppressed by the devil okay yeah so um, you just have to make sure you attend Monday evening mass I will try don't fail the masses okay thank you I'm so happy it's okay it's okay <coughs> ah sister Ruth sister good afternoon huh huh Oh, Edwin, Edwin, Edward. Huh. Father, have I said anything wrong? You see, the devil could come in different forms and shapes. The most importantly, never you allow it to overcome the fate of God in you. Now, that small girl, I saw Reverend Father Tim coming out from Felicia's house. What? Are you? Are you sure of what you just wait, said? Wait, wait, wait. Are you sure of the person you saw? Uh -uh. I don't understand you, people. Just believe me. I am sure of what I saw. Or have I gone blind? Eh? Has succeeded. Uh -huh. eh? So she has succeeded? No, she has not succeeded. She has not. She has only temporarily succeeded in bringing shame to herself. Ah! <sighs> so that tiny whip thinks she can spank an elephant. <laughs> Because of this. Because of this. Okay. No problem. Huh? No problem. Trust me what I can do. Just do something, eh? Huh? 
Are you begging me to something? No, no, she no, can't do it. Get it on. Farati, so you are bound to bring shame upon this parish. It has come to the point where you go around the village and sleeping with the members of this church. Holy Mother of God, are you trying to deny it? Just look at it. Let me tell you something. Doing it is one thing, and denying it is another. Yes! Eh? So, respect this cassacre you are wearing and stop disgracing our mother Mary. Hmm. Let me tell you, I will personally report you to the bishop for bringing shame on this parish and the Catholic community. See, he walks out on us. Right? This body has grown so many wings that he wants to fly over us. Over us. I know what to do. Something must be done. Eh? Oh, can mother me? Eh? How can they be? One way in a mandate. gone through a lot within my short stay in this parish. It's becoming more frustrating. My sister, I don't know. Eh? I don't know. I can't even pray the way, the way I want. I, I, I can't even know healing mass is conducted in this parish. In fact, I, I can't even go anywhere. I'm beginning to wonder if these people truly worship God at all. This is becoming more frustrating. This is frustrating. Look at it, they are even planning an allegation against me to report to the bishop. Never mind. I, 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 we'll talk about it tomorrow, okay? I, I have to pray now, okay? I'll talk about it tomorrow. Good night.
You just pass the house. You just pass the house. It's after this compound now. The next one. Uh -huh. You just pass it. But after this one, the next one. I'm even going there. I can even show you there. Okay, yes. fine. Leave me there. Thank you. I have seen those marks. Those four marks represent a very dangerous one. And let me tell you, I am Onyoma, the son of my father, Madu. He sent me to come and see those marks. And as I'm talking to you, those marks represent the king, Ori, and Paul. And who wrote those things on my doorstep? Those marks I just saw in there can only be written by the oracle of this land or the chief priest. Onyokochu, mm -hmm. it is a very dangerous mark, a very dangerous warning. I don't know what is going around this place, but I must tell you the truth. Odinjo. Okay, thank you very much, sir. May the peace of the Lord be with you and your family in all this. Love it. This morning, and I saw four native marks written on my doorsteps. You know, white chalk. When I made an inquiry, I got to understand that it has to do with the oracle of this land. Paratim, like you rightly said, the mask could only have been written by an oracle. Then what is the reason of writing it? There is an invitation for you to go and pay homage to the oracle of the land. That's what applies to those who come in here for the first time. Yes. Okay. A Roman Catholic priest pay homage to a bloody, bloody oracle. You see, that's my problem with you. You claim to know too much when you know nothing. Eh? That equally applies to any stranger who is coming here with evil intention or bad mind. What, what, what is all this you're saying? What's the meaning of this? Like I told you, you have to go and pay homage to the oracle or you face the wrath or better still the oracle will visit you by himself that will be dangerous you can go
just so. So the thought running through my mind. Well, I came to tell you that food is ready. Can I serve your meal now? Thank you. I'm not hungry. I didn't mean to upset you. Fatty. I said, I'm not hungry. What? Don't you understand the simple language again? Please leave. Leave. Let me have my fire time. Father, are you walking me away from your house just because I asked you to come and leave?
enough is enough. Lord Jehovah, you are the ancient rock of ages. Who is he that want to contend with thee, O God? Hey, God. Oh, my God. You are the one that searched the deep things. And your word says, O oh God, that whatsoever I bind on earth is bound in heaven. You give me the power and authority, and no one can contend with it, O oh God. Lord God Jehovah, whosoever who that is standing against God's anointed, this day, O oh God, by fire, by force, and destroy them by fire. Lord God Almighty, your word says that your word is fire, and it's, it's a ministering angel. Right now, I send forth fire upon any man or woman, born of a woman, sitting against me, trying to stop what God has for me. In the name of Jesus, I destroy you by fire. Make a coldness and Make a candle Whatsoever you redeem, whatever you reveal, you have redeemed it. Any strange man, any strange woman sitting on your council, they stand by fire. Faratin, you need not tell me what Uma Bale community looks like because I already know. <laughs> and I also know that Father Isaiah being from that community, we behave that way. And there will be no godly activity in that parish. No. That is why I sent you there. Because I know that as a vibrant and charismatic Reverend Father, they are going to make a difference there. But, Your Lordship, this is more than I can handle. Because it is practically a war between me and the community. It is not so. It's not a war between you and the community. Because the angels are there. You are not alone. You are not alone. I remember what the Bible said. That uh, we can do all things through Christ Jesus. Who strengthens us. So all the angels are there to protect and guide you. My Lord, my Lordship, I, I can still remember everything very well. But, but nothing, Father. Nothing, Father Tim. All you have to do is to be more prayerful. To be more prayerful and to be mentally and spiritually alert and apply some wisdom in your way. That's all you need. Thank you very much for your words of encouragement. Hey, hey you! Stop there! Hey. Hey. So you thought you could escape us, eh? Mm -hmm. You thought you could escape us. Mm. Mm. This is the last time we are going to warn you concerning this issue. You stay away from Father Tim. Have you heard? But I have nothing to do with him. He just stayed. Hey. Hey. Oh, you are even talking bad at eh? Listen to me. The next time I see you anywhere near Father Tim, if I ever see you around Father Tim, next time you feel more pain than this. Idiot. Be a man of faith.
captain sisters. <laughs> captain, Hello, how may we help you? Um, sorry, sisters. Is Father Tim around? Is he in the house? No. Um, he left the parish a few minutes ago. He's not around. Oh, okay, it's okay then. I'll just call him. Eh? Eh? No, 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 no. Ah. You don't do that. It's not permitted in this parish. You can call him from here. No, not at all. It's okay, sisters. I'll call him when I leave. Thank you, sisters. Bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Can you imagine? Oh, that's a very place. Yeah, please. Please, get that thing. Oh, my goodness. Has he gone to pay homage as the oracle demanded? He refused. That boy is stubborn. I wonder what is giving him confidence. But I'm going to show him I am more stubborn than he is. Can you imagine for a team telling me to my face that he would not do it? To my face? Then what do you intend to do? I am still planning. Yeah. I am plotting. By the time I'm through with him, he will come and beg me to go and pay homage to the oracle of my father's land. Yes, I trust you. I know what you can do. That's why you're like this. Let's go. I'll go look for a veil and cover my face while walking around this community. Are you not ashamed of yourself? <laughs> Why should I do that? Just take a good look at me. I am more beautiful than you are, so I think you should be the one to cover your ugly face with a veil. Yes. See who is talking. Look at her. See who is talking. Just pray that the Pope finally passes the law of Reverend Father's getting married. In that way, he might be saved.
Father, there is something that is going on in the parish and we thought you should know about it. What is it? Father, there is this girl that has been visiting Father Tim. Her name is... Uh, Love it. Good. Love it. Father, that is her name. Father, she comes to visit Father Tim every day. Sometimes even twice the same day. Mm -hmm. She even sleeps in his room, Father. As we speak, she might even be in his apartment right now. <laughs> mm. Is that why the two of you left your duties? To come here in another gossip? Eh? Let me advise you. Go back to your office and face your duties. <laughs> But father, I said go back to your office and face your duty. Leave my office. You told me we should let him. But father, I said go to your office. Go and face your duties. Yeah. 
There is this particular dream I'm having for some time now. What is that about, Father? I'm always hearing very strange and horrible sound in the dream. As if the whole house will collapse. And when I wake up, I see nothing. To seek the face of God. Yeah. Before it gets out of hand. You're right. The Lord will see you through. You only need him to see you through all these challenges. Amen. Disappointed in you. How could you? How could you be keeping a girl in this parish? And who is this girl, if I may ask? Love it. The girl that always comes here to visit you. There's nothing canal between Love it and I. Well, if she's not your girlfriend, what is she to you? Why is she always coming here? Look, it sounds so irritating when you use that word, girlfriend. And since when did I become this ungodly, keeping a girlfriend? Hey, please stop, stop using such a derogatory word. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I believe you. Leave! Leave before I strike an angle of God upon you! 